Good morning guys, so today is my second dose vaccination day. Enjoy the vlog. I'm now doing my common morning skincare routine. Nothing special, so I'll just do a time lapse of it. And I'll show you my body care routine, okay? So just stay tuned. And I think I'm not quite confident to show you guys my, I mean my bare face. So I'm sorry, I just had to put that emoji, okay? So next, kita move on dengan my body care routine which is shower scrub, body lotion and also this body scrub from Scarlett. The first step is body scrub and I'm using the new variant from Scarlett which is coffee. So, scrub ni mengandungi butiran halus yang sangat lembut untuk mengembalikan kelembapan kulit. Selain itu, coffee body scrub ini juga dapat membantu mengangkat sel-sel kulit mati pada tubuh which is very good untuk menanggalkan daki-daki. I use this scrub for only 1 to 2 times a week to prevent myself from over exfoliating. And it also contains glutathione and vitamin E that will also to help to brighten our skin. And then I just scrub it gently all over my skin. After scrubbing, I let alone for about 3 to 5 minutes and then rinse it. It is 250 ml big and can be used up until 3 to 4 months based on our using. And do not worry, semua products from Scarlett adalah cruelty free and also halal. And ia juga telah mendapat pengesahan daripada BPOMRI. After I rinse it, I dab it softly using a clean towel. The next step is coffee shower scrub from Scarlett. Ianya mengandungi beads iaitu butiran halus untuk mengembalikan kelembapan kepada kulit kita. Seperti body scrub, shower scrub juga mengandungi glutathione dan vitamin E dan juga collagen. Bezanya ialah shower scrub dapat digunakan untuk kegunaan harian. Selain dapat mengembalikan kelembapan kulit, Coffee shower scrub juga dapat mengangkat sel-sel kulit mati serta mencerahkan kulit. Pada packaging botol ini juga terdapat cara pemakaian shower scrub. Seperti biasa, keringkan tubuh menggunakan tuala bersih selepas bilas. And the last step is Jolly Body Lotion from Scarlett. The first thing I notice about this body lotion is the scent that is inspired from YSL Black Opium. Body lotion ini dapat mengembalikan nutrisi kulit dan dapat menyegarkan serta memberikan keharuman tahan lama. Ia juga mengandungi niacinamide yang juga berfungsi untuk mencerahkan kulit. Selain itu, ia juga mengandungi kojic acid, lutathione dan vitamin E. A friendly reminder, you guys can use body scrub for only 1 to 2 times a week and shower scrub then body lotion every day. So I think that is all for my body care routine products. If you guys want to purchase it, boleh click link on my description box, okay? So this is my fit check. <laughs> Drippy. Of the day. Perjalanan from my house to the vaccination centre wasn't that far Dalam 20-30 minit je Tapi sebab ada roadblock tadi lambat sikit Dalam 40 minit kot Finally I'm here My second dose vaccination centre is UITM Dungun And the weather is so so 
hot I swear to God it was so hot Tapi sebaik kat tempat tu um, Kurang orang Tapi still panas lah Tapi banyak kipas So here is station 1 Station 1 Kita tunggu orang untuk pergi ke station 2 tu lah Ya yeah. So I'm now at station 2 So waiting at station 4 there is quite many people Tapi okey lah sebab ada banyak kipas And I am at the last row So waiting and Yeah After tunggu around 20 to 30 minutes I am finally at the first row Waiting Dia tak lama sangat tapi The flow is very smooth And now I am in the day one To get my vaccination jab Already not so many people, but it's okay. Lah. I'm good. The whole process of the jab is only took like less than 5 minutes. I only wait like 2 minutes and then they cocho and it's a jab. Gila. Very smooth the flow. And now it's already station, I don't know what station, tapi waiting for uh, orang to panggil untuk, I don't know, maybe last, I don't know what to call, yeah, and Pemandangan atas pentas sebab bus uh, foto putih dekat atas pentas. Peace, peace. Tada. Yes, bye bye. Sekarang ni all the process siap dah tapi tengah tunggu kad tu untuk laminate. Servis so, laminate ni dalam satu ringgit je. So murah. a little bit sore in my arms tapi no signs of drowsy or the mum and I'm completely fine thank god so I am now currently watching Alice in Borderland because I just finished Squid Game it was a really good key drama you guys should watch it okay? 